Are we recording? We are recording! <laughs> Welcome to Dude RV! There's a whole lot of cars here. We gotta be quick about it. I really appreciate y'all stopping by, and of course, you got here just in time, as you can see. I am at San Angelo State Park out in West Texas. And we're gonna take a ride. This is actually gonna end up being two different campground videos simply because this this park is so big I'm gonna have to do it in two different two different virtual tours this is number one get the camera mounted so y'all can participate The helmet on. The helmet cam is mounted. Now we need to find some cool tunes for the GoPro footage. Unfortunately, I can't do cool tunes yet on the Insta360. Was here six years ago on the homeward leg of a trip down to Big Bend National Park. We were quite exhausted. It was our first trip in the Class C Vesta. First trip with the uh, Triad scooter and I was having so many problems with that thing. here we were both just exhausted and burnt out so I didn't have real uh, my impression of this state park was less than stellar I have fresh eyes now now I kind of like this state park I like it a lot as a matter of fact we arrived here yesterday late afternoon we were treated to a beautiful sunset and then a beautiful sunrise this morning. Now the lake, the, the lake that this park is associated with, O.C. Fisher, is uh, at 2%. It's drought condition. It's super low. So it kind of kind of takes some of the some, some of what this park was built around the lake. So it, you're, you're kind of left hanging without a lake. But it's it has miles of trails. There's some cool stuff here. So let's go see some cool stuff. Now there's a cattle guard at every entrance to this park because over here on the right that pasture that's where part of the state longhorn herd is kept and then there's another pasture on that other side on the east side where uh, part of the state bison herd can be found Good morning. Hello, good morning. How are you doing? Good, how are you? Wonderful. They have firewood available. And there's not a burn bad. This park has got the most. This park has more. What am I trying to say? The paved road area in this Texas State Park, I think, is, is it's one of the biggest of the 72 that I've been to. This park has more paved road than any other. So we're going to kick off by 
by checking out the screen shelters, the cabins, not screen shelters, they are cabins. And they are right over here. I had the scooter on a hitch haul on the back of the motor home and Yappy was driving her car. These are all air conditioned cabins. Uh, because she was driving her car, well, because the car was here, I didn't have enough battery to do the whole park on the scooter. So I used her car to cover a lot of this park. So it wasn't that great of footage. Now the restrooms for the cabins is right over there. Kind of weird. Kind of weird how this park is laid out. It'll, it'll, that'll become clear as we progress. All right, let's go see some RV campsites. Playground here on the left, and here at the dump station, there's a really cool bird blind wildlife viewing area, courtesy of the San Angelo Lions Club. I saw three javelina helping themselves to bird seed yesterday. We are going to make a left here. You'll see that Trudy Thunder is in site number one. There are no full connection sites here. These are 50 amp. see the bison silhouette there are like five bison silhouettes out there we're not going to go out there because the only thing there is a group pavilion these sites are all relatively level they're very flat easy to walk around in now our side is backwards, the patio faces the road, but you know, we're, we're only here for two nights because Yappy's got to do her, she's, she's off working. Alright, we got to go about a mile to the next clustering of campsites. We'll put on some speed. Now you, all of that out there should be water. It's actually the, the lake should be going up into a channel here. A lot of area for this lake, but as you can see, there's just like hardly anything. Two percent. 
percent. And it's been at, in this way for years. I think two, I was reading on something that's I think the 2011. It's really hard drought, and it took it down to zero percent. These actually may be 50 amps. They are. I'm sorry, I gave you bad info. These are 50 amp campsites. to the end of the campsites. We're going to take a long loop around and see if we can find some bison and longhorns. I'll go fast. As fast as I can with the road conditions as they are.
pasture right here is the bison enclosure. Yesterday they were down here because there was water. I know we got a lot of got a lot of glare on the camera.
Park.